Hello everybody, welcome back to my Let's Play. It is night time, so I'm gonna go sleep through the night. Um, Penguino is not here to commentate, so it's just me. Yeah, he is busy doing other personal stuff. But anyway, he might be back in the next few episodes. Today, I want to get working on my quarry and some power gen for my quarry. So, what we're gonna need are some engines with buildcraft. And look them up there are redstone engines steam engines and combustion engines there's a build graft forestry adds biogas peat fired and electrical engines the one I'm looking at is an electrical engine this requires industrial craft power to run but it never overheats and it's not that expensive and only like two of them is required for a quarry so what I'm gonna do is go check over here all right my back bat, bat pack is done we can go pop that there. And I'd also like to get some better industrial craft power gen going this week. Or not this week, today. But first, I think I'd like to get my... Yeah, let's go do power gen. Because I'm going to need industrial craft power for the machine. For that, I'm going to need obsidian that I forgot one piece of to teach to my transmutation tablet. So I'm just going to bolts all over here pick up all my junk I've been growing mm -hmm. a squid uh, do I have a tree tap on me probably not I don't have anything on me um oh look at that I do all right I'm prepared so I'm gonna head over here Tap some trees. And by the way, guys, my birthday was this past week. If you probably don't know, I did Feed the Beast co op. So I would suggest watching that if you haven't. Tree tap broke. Great. Yeah, lots of exciting stuff. And I'm gonna walk over this way. Back in a circle. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And this is not that far of a walk. Mm -hmm. So anyway, I'm not going to tell you what kind of power generation I'm thinking of right now, but hence the term obsidian, I think you might be able to guess. Get some reeds, don't know why. But I'll just let you guess at that. For the, oh, oil! How did I not see this? Durr, hang on. Uh, just gonna... One of those puny ones. Alright, then. I'm gonna have to find a bigger oil spot sometime in the future. Mm -hmm. Also, I've been playing on a server lately, so if you're interested in playing on the server with me and some other guys, some of the, my other recording buddies, the, the IP will be in the description. There's a TeamSpeak server, you could join, chat with me, even if you're not on the server. Where am I going? Right, that way. So, that's pretty cool, I'll leave the IP in the description. Wait, I gotta drill. Haha. -ha. Oh, there we go. So used to being on a server where, if you like, click on dirt and sand it mines out like five blocks oh my god there's a lot of sheep here all right whatever let's get away from them mm -hmm. so onward to the lava lake am i going in the wrong direction i think i am hey no it's this way why did i cross the zombie flesh interesting um, I'm going to get a sorting machine going shortly. Have one on my server I might do a little spotlight of. It's really terrible, actually. I mean, I started building it and then just kind of added on with what I thought I should add on. It, it didn't turn out very pretty, actually. It looks very ugly. So, are you kidding me? There was a hole in the ground. 
Yes, big hole. Alright, let's hurry back and get that stuff. Uh, do I have anything on me? I can get a... How did, how did that happen? I know, not like you guys know, but... Oh my god. Alright, let's head off toward my death point. I don't know how I'm gonna get down there, but... Should have brought a water bucket. Let me go do that quick. <laughs> uh, drop some wheat. I don't care. I need to go get my stuff. There's a lot of important things on me. I know, I'm terrible at keeping stuff in a chest. Uh, bucket, bucket. Can I just pull? One, two, three. Awesome. Crafting table. See, this is why equivalent exchange is awesome. I just made a bucket out of nothing. I bet you can't do that at home. Mm -hmm. I think only in Minecraft can you just pull stuff out of nowhere with equivalent exchange. Mm -hmm. um, nope, wrong death point. We want the retarded death point up here because I fell in a hole. Can't believe I just... Okay, yeah, my, I'm not very coordinated today. Just woke up like an hour ago. So, onward this way, toward the... Oh, I might be, get started on bees sometime soon. I know I'm just rambling on about everything I want to do. But, bees are something to get started on a little earlier on than you actually should. Honestly, I might not ever get around to it. But So, if I don't get around to bees in the next few episodes, leave a comment letting me know, because I'm sure I'm going to forget. Because I'm not that good at bees anyway. Okay, there's my death point. Let's just get this water ready to place. Mm -hmm. Death point 75. Oh my gosh. That ravine was deep too. I mean, I thought I had gone around it, but I didn't. Whatever. Let's not fall in again with my only bucket of water. Oh, beautiful. Look at all that. Marvel. Oh, okay. I guess I can get the lava down there, too. Fine. Oh, I don't like mobs. Great. Oh, there's all my stuff, at least. Alright, cool. Ow. Yeah, for some reason, my achievements got reset. I didn't update my mods or anything, but Whatever. I get to do with these achievements again. So, while, while I'm down here, I might as well just, uh, where'd my drill go? Oh, Alright, that there, that there, that there. Awesome. Oh, and my backpack on me. Not the cactus, backpack. Cool. Should get a jetpack. And seeing as I'm low on iron, ha ha ha! Just kidding. Come on, get there. Oh, gosh. Funny on the server, I was turning a bunch of buckets and with tin, and then smelting them down into iron because I had absolutely no iron. And right while I was making all the buckets, the dude. That was running the server just like, oh, by the way, did I forget to turn off crafting buckets out of tin? I'm like, uh, no, it's fine. Don't worry. And he's like, no, nope, yeah, I did. t shut it down. Managed to get, like, 30 buckets, though. And he comes back on, I'm like, well, good thing I made all those buckets. And I don't think he was very happy. So, anyway, I got my quarry. That's really the most important thing here, as well as my backpack and my drill. Uh... Water's handy for stuff. Alright, let's go get the... Oh, there's water here. Okay, whatever. The nice thing about Minecraft is you can carry as much stuff as you want, but it doesn't matter how much... You could carry, like, 
an inventory full of buckets of water and your character doesn't mind. He's just like, eh, whatever. He doesn't get tired or anything. It's awesome. Um, hmm. Yeah. This is going to be a long walk back. But anyway, guys, I died this episode. I'm sure you enjoyed seeing that. And I'm probably going to die a million times in the nether, too. You know what's funny is that I use that death point, the uh, blue one right there, to find my way back home. Because I don't have a home coordinate yet. So, yeah. That's how I know when to get home. I need to do something with this big volcano here. I think I'm going to put my sorting system in there. Don't worry, guys. I have plans for plenty of episodes. Uh-oh, it's getting dark. Hmm. It's funny, this end of the, um... Or this side of the hill looks exactly like the other side. <laughs> it's weird. Take the lazy man's route. Oh, great. I need to get some ender pearls and I can get the uh, portal gun. That would be awesome. Because portal guns are awesome. Yeah, they're awesome. But what I can do is transmute to Enderman with the Philosopher's Stone, which I will show you in a different episode, because we're going to be getting to the nether this one. I hope. Alright. Um, mm -hmm. Just going to macerate that up. Alright. So, obsidian, right there. Let's totidate it to our transmutation tablet. And get... Oh, ooh, that's way too much. Alright, I could make a uh, four-dimensional another portal. Okay, at least three-dimensional. I think this calls for making a place for the portal. So, now's the time I'm going to go visit that other volcano. Hmm. I just realized this water should be frozen if we're in a uh, biome that's snow. Or oh, whatever. I'm thinking right here. Beautiful. What? There, there's like no basalt here? Oh, that's just great. I'm gonna have to cook up basalt to look pretty. You know what? I'm going up. Because I want this place to look pretty. Right here looks good. By the way, since the uh, drill functions as a shovel, I now have snowballs. You guys have the snow. Alright, this looks deep enough. Just gonna mine upward. How big's a portal? Right. Alright, I can do this. Nah, I probably can't. Okay, let's get our obsidian down. I'm gonna need a, a flint and tinder too. Am I making this too small? No. Yeah, that looks too small. Alrighty then. Wait, hang on, let's go check. <laughs> Gonna need a flint and steel anyway. Almost. Ta da! Alright, I have flint somewhere. My god, my inventory is cluttered as can be. Oh, flint. Awesome. Uh, let's put some gravel back. Down here, we can put some cobblestone and basalt and cobblestone and uh, I'm gonna need obsidian. Revert. Why am I out of inventory room? Probably because I have two chests. It's pretty sad. Alright, I had iron and flint. Cool. 
So if we, yeah, we're gonna need to close that up. It looks really messed up, actually. I'll put my sorting machine in there. All right, let's do this. All right, that's definitely not a portal. Okay <laughs> then. Didn't I make that unlock? All right, let's try this. Whoa, okay, I got it right. Hey, I like that little block. That looks cool. All right, do I have everything on me? I'm probably not going to need it. Snowballs. Awesome. I'm gonna go drop off my quarry. I don't need to be walking around with it. Philosopher's Stone is handy in the nether, so I don't fall in lava. Good thing. Also, here's where you're gonna maybe figure out what I'm gonna make. Is a pump. A... Oh my god, stupid Skype. Just forget about Skype. Alright, mining well is crafted like that, so I'm gonna need some iron. Easy enough, I have plenty of iron. And a piece of redstone. Which I also have plenty of. Characters don't need that, don't need that, don't need that. Should I just burn this stuff up? Ah, uh, I need some wood. Is that a slime I hear? I just, I just, where's the, yeah, you're a slime, whatever, I don't need slime balls right now, uh, just put that in there, going to need some more wood. Going to upgrade a gear to wooden, then to cobblestone. Yes, I probably have a gear in my chest. I'm forgetting about. Oh wow, I have a lot of gears I just forgot about. Whatever, they're not stone. So then finally, iron gear. Awesome. Take an iron gear, iron pickaxe. Iron on the sides. And a piece of redstone. Gets us a mining well. Mining well, when powered with buildcraft, will mine a one block wide hole, so this block all the way down to bedrock. It's kind of cool, but there's no real purpose of it, really. So, well, unless you want to mine a well. <laughs> uh, where'd all my glass go? Er, okay, that's not enough. Definitely not enough. Where's all my sand? <sighs> Whatever. Neat little tip is you can macerate cobblestone into sand. But I'm pretty certain I could just transmute to it. So, take that. Do I need glass? See? I'm just gonna show you this one. Because you don't need it with equivalent exchange. Sand. There. So that's neat. If only it was worth more than one EMC. Then that would just be a cheap way to get EMC. So anyway, this is all build craft at this point. You put glass like that, and get a tank. Tank can store 16 buckets of liquid. So if I place it on the ground, you can put water in there. You can take water out. See, it fills up. Little notches. It's cool. It'll store any liquid in the game, including oil and fuel from Buildcraft. And I think the Forestry Liquids, too. But anyway, you combine a tank with a mining well to get a pump. Ooh, fancy. Here's where I'm going to need these gears to power it. So you take two wooden... No, I'm going to need six wooden gears. Some wood. Uh, iron, redstone. Okay, we got this. And gobble. Three... 
Right now, I'm making pistons. But in the long run, I'm going to be making some redstone engines. I found redstone engines are the best way to power these because they never explode as long as they're powering it. They don't require any power, which is awesome, or any external source of fuel or something. And it's not that expensive. So, easy enough done. And quite easier said than done. I'm also going to want a squeezer. No, I don't want a squeezer. Alright, go back through the forestry machines. Uh, forestry, forestry. We will find it. It is called a bottler. There. The sturdy machine and empty cans. Sturdy machine is bronze. Time to make some bronze. Because I don't think I've made it ever. Uh, do I have any food? Of course not. Yes, I do. Thinking ahead. Yeah. So, bottler is going to require some bronze. In here, we have the tools for bronze. It is... I don't have the tools for bronze. Now I do. Alright. Three tin. And one copper. I screwed that up, didn't I? Alright. Let's try that again. Three copper. And one bronze. Like that. What am I doing wrong? Did I not enable this? Hang on. B R. All right, there we go. Bronze. Bronze dust. Okay, tin copper. Fine. I'll go mass rate it up. All right, whatever. You can mass rate ingots. So wait, hang on. What was the recipe again? Bronze dust is three copper, one tin. Alright, I'll try it the second time. One, two, three, four, five, six. I don't know why the recipe for bronze isn't showing up. Bronze gear would be bronze. The heck. Bronze smelting. Okay, whatever. Okay. Fine. The recipe for bronze dust is that. Okay, actually, I only need. Nah, I still need a little bit more. Alright, we will come back to that when it's done. Cans. You saw the bottler. Required empty cans. Cans are tin, like that. So, I have tin on me. This is how I'm going to transport it between the overworld and the nether. Yeah, I know. There we go. Stack and eat empty cans. Cans are also used for storing liquid. If I just pop out here quickly, you can see that you can take it up and now you have a water can. I believe you can place water like this too. No, you can't. Alright. So I'm stuck with a water can. Uh. Whatever. Um. Yeah, let's go sleep through the night. I think daytime passes way too quickly in my world. I need to get Mistcraft soon. Hopefully. Alright, now we're gonna need two tin. Yeah. <laughs> Almost there. Come on, buddy, you can do it. Need to get some overclockers. I did just see rubber in there, didn't I? Great. Alright, let's drop off a million stuff that I don't need. Uh, I don't need flint, that, that, that. Yeah, I gotta get a sorting system going. I will do that next episode. I need four. Okay. One tin dust. Gold ingot. Mm hmm. Crap. 
Yeah, I'm really running low on inventory room. Alright. I thought I had a crafting table in here. Need to make one then. Oh, duh, because I have my Philosopher's Stone on me. Yep, that's why I didn't have one. Alright. Take two tin. Combine that into bronze dust. To like, get four bronze dust. Uses for that. Oh, I'm gonna need more bronze. But it has an EMC value. Awesome. Did not notice that. So we smelt up bronze dust to get bronze, obviously. Um, yeah. Bronze, here we come. So, what was around there? 255. Wow, it's a little less than iron. Awesome. Let's make sure. If you're uncertain about whether it has an EMC value, and with especially earlier ones with equivalent exchange where it didn't show the EMC value, put it in here if it doesn't fit. For instance, redstone engine, if you can't place it in there, that means it doesn't have an EMC value. But now I can just transmute right into bronze. Six. Alright, let's just get two more. Awesome. Come over here to my crafting table. I don't know why. I don't use the Philosopher's Stone more, but there. Sturdy machine. That's how it's crafted. Gonna take... This is a forestry machine, by the way. Get our empty cans on the side. This also requires buildcraft power. But I don't really feel like doing anything right now with it. So, I think I'm going to make a Lapatron crystal. Or, okay, not a Lapatron. A... Oh, what's it called? Uses for diamond. <laughs> I know, this is probably the wrong approach to this. It is called a... Don't worry, I'll find it. It's in here somewhere. What is that? Oh, interesting. Uh, it's not in here. Whatever, I know how to craft it. Take a, take a diamond, surround it. I can't believe I'm not thinking of the name. It is a energy crystal. There we go. Alright, this holds a whole lot of power. In fact, it holds plenty more than the bat box. You can't even place it in a bat box. Great. Um, can I charge it up? No, okay. Now is a good time to get an MFE. Because I really need to get an electrical engine down there. So, just get three more of these. Yeah, it's kind of expensive, but it holds a lot more power. I don't have enough. Da -da -da. Let me think about this. There we go. That's enough. Three, and then put our diamonds in there. Awesome. Uses for energy crystal. It was like that. Okay, they did. Whoa, cool. Energy crystal and copper cable with a machine block. I can do that. Where's that rubber? Okay. Copper cable. Yay. Where's all that excess rubber I had? Cool. Alrighty. Bam. Machine block. Well, you need some iron smelt up. Yeah, refined iron doesn't have an EMC value. There we go. Yeah, guys, I think I'm gonna have to get my quarry running in the next several episodes, actually. Because right now I'm working on industrial craft power. Which I will also be getting in the next episode. Funny. Um... So, going to need to get a wrench in a minute. Also requires bronze, actually. What? No, get that back there. Alright, wrench with industrial craft is bronze like that. So, just 
keep that in the back of your mind while I forget about it. Six, seven, yeah, I'm gonna go do that right now. Actually, do do do. Four, two, three, four. Five, six, that's enough. No, it's not, it's eight. No, it's not, it, uh. How many is this? Ignore the background noise if you can hear that. That's one, five, six. Okay, I was right. So, we'll craft it up like this. There we go. The build craft, no, industrial craft wrench allows you to remove machines safely when you right click on them. So don't do that accidentally. There is a chance to lose a machine and you'll just get a machine block. But, there is a way to fix that. Exactly. You'd like, where'd all my redstone go? Oh, I used it all up. Hang on. I shall get me some redstone. Or I'm gonna need six. No, I'm just gonna need four. All right, over here, over here. Make a electronic circuit because we're gonna make a better wrench. After all, better is better, right? So, take this and that, making a battery and electronic circuit. Easy enough to follow, right? RE battery, electronic circuit, and your wrench gives you a rechargeable wrench. Electric, that is. Electric wrench can be charged up, obviously. And an electric, oh wow, that's fast. All right, electric wrench is special because if you hold M and right click to change mode, lossless wrench mode, ooh, fancy. So now if you right click, it uses a lot more energy, but it's guaranteed to get you what you need. So that's awesome. And just wait for one more iron because I used up one. And bam. Craft up machine block. Machine block. And uh, what's the recipe? Er. Do do do. M F E. Oh, right, my electronic crystals. Er, energy. Alright, just get this crafted up. Mm -hmm. Nope, wrong one. And. Almost. Awesome, we have ourselves an MFE. So, now what we need is a transformer. Let's go get that. Uh, because an MFE outputs medium voltage and my machines can only use low voltage. So transformer it has nothing to do with the transformers, by the way. Copper cable, co no, copper, copper cable, and wood. Cool, I don't have any copper cable. Ugh, really? Don't worry, I got plenty of copper. Just going to make that. No, that's not what I wanted. Still need to make this. All right, there, 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 there. Do I not have any wood? Uh, how can I not? Actually, it's probably a simple question. Or a simple answer, whatever. Uh, there, take that back. That, 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 that. LV transformer. This will take medium voltage and turn it into low voltage. How am I going to do that, you say? Well, I'm going to have to break. Generator, it's the basic tier, so if you break it, it's going to give you generator no matter what. Alright, we'll just uh, come down here to our little basement area. Actually, I'm going to probably need to uh, dig down one more. Awesome. So, what I'm gonna do down here, you might ask, is remove my bat box. Uh, yeah, I don't have anything to charge it up with, I don't think. Oh, well, okay, my bat pack. Do do do. 
awesome. Make sure this is in lossless. Lossless enabled and then right click. That will change the side. Right click on the output face again and it's gone. Cool, now we can get our MFE, but first, before we go blowing everything up, break our cable, place down our transformer. This is very important, or else all your machines will blow up from the voltage. The three dots is the input, so we want that facing up. Tip about wrenches is if you hold shift and right click on a face, it makes the opposite one. So right there, now it's up top, and I'm positive. We place our MFE now. No explosions is good. That's awesome, actually. And our MFE is... Should is... Oh, right, it's nighttime. That's why it's not getting any power. Alrighty, then. We will get that fixed. And I can show you the cool thing about MFEs. Which is not a lot, actually. <laughs> there's not much cool stuff. But anyway, there's power, and it's flowing into my machines, so... We obviously know something's good is happening. We can just make sure it's working. Awesome, everything's cool. It's flowing through the transformer and it's cool. Now I could put transformer upgrades that in here, but you can see it requires a lot more and that's a lot cheaper and it works for everything. There we go. So I don't need my generator really. And I'll put it back just to cover up the floor. Cool. So, MFE now is awesome, because MFEs are cool. And looks like we've gone over 30 minutes, which is what I'm aiming for this episode. So stay tuned next time, where we're actually going to put some bigger power supply into this. With another portal, you should have an idea. And bottler, pump, etc. Give you a good idea of how I'm going to do that. But in the meantime, I will see you in the next episode. Bye, guys.